Eminem and Dr. Dre signs Filipino rapper Esmil. Hey guys, today we're going to be talking about Eminem and Dr. Dre signs Filipino rapper Esmil. Let's get right into it. Ezekiel Miller, a Filipino-American artist who goes by the stage name Esmil, is making significant strides in the music industry. This young rapper, singer, and songwriter has recently garnered the attention of two hip-hop legends, Eminem and Dr. Dre, both of whom have received the esteemed honor of winning Grammy Awards. At just 25 years old, Esmil has achieved an extraordinary milestone in his budding career. He joins the ranks of renowned rapper 50 Cent by securing a direct joint deal with three of the most prominent record labels in the music business. This unique and prestigious collaboration involves Eminem's Shady Records, Dr. Dre's Aftermath Entertainment, and the widely recognized Interscope Records. To share the exciting news, Shady Records used their social media platforms. They uploaded a photo that featured both Eminem and Dr. Dre standing alongside the rising star, Ez Mill. The caption accompanying the memorable image read, Still Aftermath, back at it with Dr. Dre to sign the incredibly talented Ez Mill. Eminem didn't hesitate to share his enthusiasm as well. On his Instagram account, he reposted the same photograph and added his personal touch with a caption, Me and Dre back at it. Check out Ezekiel Miller, aka Esmil out. But he didn't stop there. Eager to introduce the talent of Esmil to his massive following, Eminem took to Twitter and shared one of Esmil's tracks. The song titled Up Down Step and Walk came with a brief note from the rap legend himself. Eminem told his fans that this particular track was why we signed him. If you've been to the Shady Records website lately, you might have stumbled upon the mention of Esmil's single Up Down. This particular song, which is part of his album, Duality, was launched through Virgin Music. The captivating rhythms and beats of Up Down immediately caught the ears of ardent Eminem followers, as many drew parallels between Esmil's unique style and Eminem's iconic rhythm patterns. As the universe would have it, roughly a month after the song's release, Eminem himself happened to hear Up Down. Much to everyone's excitement, he was deeply impressed by what he heard. Without missing a beat, Esmil found himself on the journey from the bright lights of Las Vegas to the sprawling cityscape of Los Angeles. The reason? To meet the legendary duo Dr. Dre and Eminem in person for the very first time. This face-to-face -face encounter ignited an immediate camaraderie between Esmil and Eminem. It was clear that their mutual respect and shared passion for music were catalysts for something big. The two artists joined forces to craft a song titled Realist. This collaboration is a testament to their combined genius. Every beat, rhyme and lyric of Realist resonates with the mastery of rap. The track brims with intricate rhyme patterns, clever lyrical nuances and a beat that gets your heart racing, all reminiscent of the distinct style that Eminem is celebrated for. Capitalizing on this successful partnership, Eminem took a monumental step by welcoming Esmil to the fold of the three illustrious record labels. Eminem will be personally overseeing the curation of Duality Redux. Notably, this will mark Esmil's concluding release under the banner of Virgin Music. We've never been out there signing a lot of artists, and one of the great things about how we built Shady is how selective we've been, Eminem said. Building on that, Eminem highlighted a rare occurrence in their signing history. And it's even rare that Dr. Dre and I signed something together, but I heard Ez's music and was like, this is really special. Excitedly sharing it with Dre, the response was unanimous. We both agreed it would be a great fit, and we wanted to work with him right on the spot. He added, emphasizing the instant connection they felt with Esmil's sound. Dr. Dre, another pillar in the music world, chimed in with his own perspective. He shared, I'm really only interested in working on shit that sounds different from anything else going on out there, and only then if I feel I can really bring something to it. Detailing his first interaction with Ez's music, Dr. Dre revealed, M played me Ez, and I had that feeling, that thing that happens when we both know we found something special, and that was it. Let's get to work. Zooming out a bit, let's delve into Ez Mill's backstory. Hailing from Cebu City in the Philippines, he wasn't just another kid on the block. From a tender age, music flowed through his veins. Over the years, he mastered the art, creating a unique blend of traditional Filipino melodies infused with today's rap beats. But what truly sets him apart is his lyrical prowess. His thought-provoking words combined with the fervor of his performances resonated deeply with audiences worldwide. His breakthrough moment arrived in 2020. A video of him energetically performing Panalo on the Wish 107.5 bus music series started doing rounds on social media platforms. It wasn't just his unparalleled talent that was evident, but the way he dominated the stage with his rapid-paced lyrics, clever word choices, and impeccable rhythm. The reaction from audiences was nothing short of overwhelming. This video propelled Ez Mill to the forefront of the music scene, earning him legions of fans and accolades from across the globe. 
It's clear that this young artist's journey is only the beginning, and with industry titans like Eminem and Dr. Dre backing him, the sky is the limit. That's all for today, and we'll be sure to catch you all in the next one.